the Making Strides Against Breast Cancer Walk in Cincinnati. The yearly fundraiser by the American Cancer Society brings people from across the tri-state for a singular cause here, raising money for research and to treat patients and eventually beat breast cancer. That's the overall goal here. Joining me now, Charlotte Duggan from the American Cancer Society. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. This is a huge event. It draws uh, thousands of people here to the tri-state to take the walk from one side of the river to the other and back across. Yep. Um, the, fo the focus with the forecast, though, is that going to be a concern for you guys tomorrow? Not at all. Okay. Our event is rain or shine. Um, we recognize that breast cancer never stops, so neither do we in our fight against it. So sure. just uh, dress appropriately, bring your pink raincoats and your pink ponchos, and we'll be continuing on. All right, and if anybody is watching out there right now and they say, oh my gosh, I totally forgot about this, I spaced, I didn't get a team together, can an individual person just come out and register yes, and walk? Yes, yep. So you can register as an individual walker either online or you can even show up tomorrow morning and check right. in at our registration tent and we can get you signed up right there. It's free to participate. We just encourage donations. And the money raised from this goes to, as we mentioned, treatment and research. And research has been really key the past several years. There have been some major breakthroughs. I guess, how much did you raise last year? What do you, do you have a goal set for this yes. year? Yes, okay. so last year we raised um, about 480,000. Okay. So we're nice. hoping to sustain that again this year if we can. Um, and to your point, it does support research as well as local patient support services. So we're fortunate to have our Hope Lodge here in Cincinnati, which is a free place for people to stay if they have to travel here for cancer treatment. Um, so we're able to support our Hope Lodge and things like that through this event. So it's kind of like a hotel, they get to stay there during treatment and they don't yes. have to travel back and forth exactly. during their treatment. And all yep. that. Uh, I know a lot of different companies get involved in this and, and groups, people are there to honor even loved ones who who lost their lives due to, to breast cancer. Uh, if there are folks out there that have teams, I mean, there's a kind of a competition within a competition, so to speak, in this. Who's the winning team right now as far as fundraising? Right now, it is our Avon team. Okay. We're very excited they came on board as a national partner for Making Strides nationwide this year. And here in Cincinnati, they've done a phenomenal job of really rallying their troops. And so they're currently holding down the first spot as top fundraising team. Well, Kristen Hartman uh, is a big supporter of this. Tamika Artist also, uh, they'll be out there in full force. And I wish you the, the best. Where can people go if they want to just donate online and maybe not even go to the walk? Where can they go? Yep, you can go to www.makingstrideswalk.org slash Cincinnati. Slash Cincinnati. Yep. Very important. We <laughs> want some of those dollars to stay right here in the Cincinnati area. Well, Charlotte, yes. thank you so much for spending time with us. Thank you. And good luck tomorrow. Thank you so much. Of course, all pressure on uh, Steve Raleigh as well. <laughs> but again, the, the walk tomorrow at Yeaman's Cove registration starts at 8 o'clock in the morning. The walk starts at 9 and again, Nine on Your Side anchor Kristen Hartman will be out there, and Nine on Your Side has a team raising money as well. We certainly hope to see all of you out there.